Hi girls and guys, it's Mr. Tracky and we're on the right track. Welcome to episode 2 of my Call of Duty Black Ops 4 Specialist Guide series. In today's episode, I'm going to teach you how to use Ajax. Now Ajax has come under great scrutiny from the Call of Duty community. He's definitely a love or hate specialist. A lot of people are under the belief that he's overpowered and uh, this may be true to some degree. However, today I'm actually going to teach you how to make Ajax overpowered. But before we do that, let's take a closer look at Ajax. Now Ajax comes with his equipment, which is one of these, a nine bang. And if you charge it for just under three seconds, it will render enemies useless for around six seconds. Now on their screen, they will hold their hand up and they will be flashed out of their mind. It does reduce their movement also. And basically once you've used it, you can literally move in and get free kills if you're quick enough off the move to get these people that you've nine bang. You will get 15 points for flashing an enemy and then you'll get a further 25 points on top of the kill if you seal the deal while that while that person's flashed. So for your nine bangs, your initial nine bang will charge in 30 seconds and then it will charge up every 60 seconds thereafter. In terms of the shield, this is the bread and butter, the meat and two veg of Ajax. He has an insane ability. Now he has a riot shield, which you can fortify by using the uh, L2 button. And basically it, it, it's such a nightmare for people that are in front of it. You can counter it. We're not gonna cover that in vi this video because I am gonna do a separate video about that. But once you have your shield out, you can put a <laughs> basically a nine millimeter automatic pistol through a little letterbox and just spray the hell out of your enemies. Now this does come with a 100 bullets, massive 100 bullets in the magazine. And it basically is a spray and pray sort of thing. There is absolute no need to reload it at all. Now the great thing about Ajax is whilst his ability is out, you can run forward at enemies and put pressure on them and then fortify yourself again. Now this is a great ability to use in certain circumstances. You all know that I play TDM quite a lot. So it's great in close quarter combat, places where you know people tend to hang around. Now we're playing slums right here and most people who know this map t tend to know that where I'm situated now, a lot of people are going to come from that top right hand corner. So that is the perfect place for me to post up, especially if you know your teammates are behind you, because that's where people will get you with this ability is shooting you in the back when you're, you leave yourself quite vulnerable once you've got your shield up. But if you want multi kills in this game in core, then this is the specialist that you're going to need to use to get those. It's a nine bang and you rush in with the shield and just take full advantage. You will get 10 points for blocking any types of shot per, per enemy. So you get an additional 10 points every time you start blocking bullets. Uh, obviously you will get 125 for the kill with the likes of the shield. And then if you think about it, some players have got armor on as well. So that will be 150 points. What you will no notice with Ajax very, very quickly is that you will amass a lot of points towards your score streaks. And before you know it, you will have a lot of score streaks coming into the map. And this is why I love using him because more often than not, he will actually give me a good return when I use his specialist ability. And that's why I believe he is probably the best specialist out there because in terms of kill to death ratio and earning kills, some specialists won't get you any kills with their ability, but they're still very helpful, i.e. Uh, recon. But in terms of the, what I call power specialist abilities, the batteries of the game, the ruins of the game, I believe Ajax will get you the best return in terms of using his ability. So Mr. Trekkie, how do you make Ajax overpowered? Well, it's quite simple and it's one piece of equipment that will totally change this guy 
in my personal opinion, is already a very, very powerful, if not the most powerful specialist. But just one piece of equipment will turn him into an absolute monster. Now, I've previously said already in this video that he will get nine bangs every 60 seconds, 30 for the initial, but there are now after is every 60 seconds. Now, if you take your piece of gear and change that to equipment charge, you'll get your flashbangs every 40 seconds. So nine bangs every 40 seconds in the game, which is pretty powerful considering not many people can counter these, especially if they're fully charged to their full nine bang ability. And with some methodical placement, you saw at the start of the video, I went behind the wall, charged my nine bang a little bit and threw it out and just literally went and cleaned up the kills real easy it will help you get your streaks so so easy and it will just turn your your kd really high because not many not many people actually know how to deal with ajax so making him a bit more powerful with the equipment charge is obviously going to make him even more hard to handle now i've done some testing and without any kills in a game just letting your ability charge up it will take a full four minutes for you to get your shield uh, with Ajax. If you do this with the equipment charge, then you'll get your ability every three and a half minutes. Now, remember, please remember that this is obviously accelerated every time you get a kill. So you can already imagine having a 30% uh, reduction in the time it's going to take you on top of you getting kills as well you'll you'll likely get this ability two to three times per tdm which is very powerful when you consider how long it lasts for in fact this specialist ability will last for a massive 30 seconds now that doesn't sound like a lot of time until you're up against this guy trying to kill him his shield will stay out for 30 seconds and he's got 100 in the magazine so you can imagine even when you deplete your magazine you still have your shield available for 30 seconds so it is a massive problem for when people come up against ajax and i can see to a degree why people believe that he is overpowered for me i really enjoy using him uh, he will give some people a problem with his sensitivity uh, it's nothing like when you're aiming down sight. Uh, so if you work off a very high sensitivity, uh, it's going to take some time getting used to when you're actually shooting uh, this pistol through the letterbox. It, it's almost, it's very, very twitchy, very, very twitchy. But once you get the knack of it, believe you me, it will cause some problems. And here's me just flashing people now with the nine bang. And you can see there's no retaliation. I'm picking up three kills here and this is why these gameplays are coming out. I died a few times in this game but these were some of the first few games I actually played with Ajax. Now I have got a class suggestion for you guys and we're going to go through it right now just to let you know how I like to play with Ajax because there is lightweight that I do run uh, with him so when you've got the shield out you can actually charge ball charge people and just <laughs> watch them run it's so hilarious so let's head over to the class and let you guys know exactly what i use for this particular specialist so the weapon needs no introduction this is the icr uh it's very reminiscent to me of the acr which has always been my favorite weapon in call of duty it's so easy to use and in the hands of a real real marksman people are going to get obliterated i use red dot on it and then i use two grips because uh, actually one grip actually gives you uh, toughness from black ops 2 so when people are shooting you you don't actually flinch and then I have FMJ on there to shred people's armor because armor really annoys me in this game. The only problem I still have with it is people say, oh, there's a counter. But when four, five, six enemies are running uh, the likes of armor, there's nothing you can do because you are not going to kill them in time uh, to go through the lot of them with the magazine that you've got in the ICR. And you don't get extended mags on this weapon from my belief. 
There is the all important equipment charge in my gear. This will get you Ajax's specialist ability much faster and basically you will become a absolute problem when you use him correctly. Uh, for my perks, scavenger in tier one, because I like to replenish my ammo. I do go on quite high streaks with this particular setup so definitely need that additional ammo lightweight so you can ball charge people with the likes of ajax's shield and then dead silence because i just like to monitor uh, where people are and i hate hearing my own footsteps in fact every single tier three perk i use uh, the likes of dead silence so guys that is my setup and that is how you make ajax overpowered so guys, let me know down in the comment section if he is one of your favorite specialists. Have you even played with him yet? And tell me if you're going to actually try this class out and give it a go. Please let me know in the future if you're having any success with him. Come back to this video and just let me know down in the comment section and I will continue to do this series because I know you guys have asked me to. Guys, there are many buttons you can hit, but the like and subscribe button, update to your fancy. And as always guys, don't forget to stay on the right track. Peace.